Welcome, friends! I knew you'd come, so I've been practicing my greetings. How much did you, do you have to destroy before you can have your have your fill, Kefka? I've acquired the ultimate power. Observe. Such magnificent power! You're nothing more than fleas compared to me now. Embrace your destruction. It is the fate of all things. To be destroyed? Maybe it is. But people can always rebuild, and new lives can always be born. And on time will be destroyed as all those things as well. Why do people insist of creating things when it will inevitably be destroyed? Why do people cling to life knowing that they must someday die? Knowing that none of it will will have meant anything once they do. Because it's not the end that matters. It's knowing that you have something to live for right now, at this moment. Something you've worked for. Something that's worth protecting. As long as you have that, that's enough. And you did get you all for find your something in this broken world just that just won't die. Yes. Love. A person worth protecting. A wife and a child who I've live who live on within me. Friends and family. A peaceful kingdom. A loving brother who always looks out for me. <laughs> Someone willing to accept me for who I am. An adorable little granddaughter. An obnoxious grandpa who I couldn't live without. Wings from a dear old friend. New pals, Kipo. Blech! You people make me sick. You sound like Rhymes from a self-help book. If that's how it's going to be, I'll snuff them all out! Every last one of your sickening, happy little reasons for living. No! Kafka, stop! Wield the greatest power in existence! You may as well be the debt at the bottom of my boots! Or the deck sucked the bottom of that debt! I'll destroy everything! I'll create my own empire of death! You can't destroy everything. People always have dreams. No! I'll destroy the entire world! There won't be anything left to dream about! We won't let you hurt any more people. <laughs> but what fun is destroying if no precious lives are lost? It ends here, Kef- It ends here, Kefka.
Scythe and Anticipation. Hello everyone, welcome back to my Let's Play of Final Fantasy VI. In the last episode, we fought off against the Warring Triad. And in this episode, we finally get to face off against Kefka. Once and for all. And apparently it's not asking for a participation order. I'm not sure what it means. But hopefully we didn't we won't have to move in past the three we have here. But just in case, let's set up for let's set up for everything. And it seems Gefka is ready to bring in the final to bring up every all the trumpets of war. To destroy every single thing just to prove that nothing can exist. To build an empire of death. Well, clearly we're gonna have to we're gonna have to fix that and knock the living and knock that and knock the nonsense straight out of him. It's oh, that silly clown. I believe that is what I want. I think for the time being. I think I'm just gonna destroy everything. It's probably safest to say it's best I get rid of everything, whatever it, whatever it is I'm attacking. Final music. This is it. That moment we've been waiting for of getting rid of Kefka. And it's finally here. I almost can't believe it. Waited for this too long. And I'm not about to let some deranged clown ruin it. Or God knows whatever that or God knows what this is. Shout out to the music though. Nobu Umatsu? You went all out on this, I can tell. God, does it sound beautiful, though. And I will just spam all the ultimate till this side of him is done, is gone. Alright, it looks like one of his hands is... One of them are gone. And now it gets awesome! You know it's gotten serious! Oh god, it's Quake. No god, no 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 Stop that! Apparently I mean- Wow, I- Oh! I guess first- I guess he's- Ah, I see. An entire- a literal tower of Kefka I'm having to fight. And then music changes. That's interesting. That is very interesting indeed. I think I like. Hmm. Curious. What else have you. What tricks. Have, oh god. You. No. Stop it. I say we get rid of we get rid of everything. It seems like there's a lot more targets too as well to get rid of. I'm not sure how to actually approach that, how to actually see that. But well, red, let's get a hashtag on everyone, so that we can so that way we can, I can be able to proceed fast, so that way can everyone can move faster and I can get worried about getting rid of everyone as I can. Oh, you are going to do that, aren't you? Hello. Since I have no need to, <laughs> since I have no need for money now, since this is literally the final boss, let's get rid of them. Let's get, let's just let's just use it all to get rid to hurt him. I, I still honestly can't believe we've gone. We're we're already here. Journey's been, it's been such a long journey, and now we're fi facing off against the man we've swore to take out for the from the very beginning. 
his little trollish ways. That's silly, Kefka. And now he comes as a giant tower with the most awesome music I've heard in a while. Sweet. I don't know who I just killed. Okay, so I killed that machine looking. I, I guess I destroyed the machine looking thing. So all that's left is that hunched over man, the weird mall looking thing, and Kefka. At least what I, I suppose is supposed to represent, represent in Kefka. Kefka. <laughs> Honestly, though, so far, he's not that bad. This guy isn't that terrible. Compared to the Kaiser Dragon, at least. That guy was. That guy was a fool! That guy was a crazy fool. Tenet combo. Hmm. 10,000 fists in the face! And that's very scary. Hmm. Wonder who I killed that caused that Tenet combo to hit. I'm curious, actually. Oh, it was one of those two. Okay. Hmm. Ah, you're gonna go that route. Get rid of the dispel. Hmm. Okay. Second phase of Kef of Kef because tower has been destroyed, and we rise even higher. To who do we find here? Looks like we're having more heavenly clouds now. Looks like Kefka there and some angelic figure. Hmm. <laughs> Double strike! Oh yeah! Wait, who did I just kill? What did I just kill? So I heard that de the definite "you've killed something" sound. Um, just be just as a precaution, I'm going. Let's get some re let's get some re raises on everyone while I'm here. Oh, I guess I killed the goddess-like figure already. Okay, not sure how I was able to do that, but sure. Can I get rid of that sap off of my off of me by doing that? I'm curious is that, if that works that way. Very love the use of the organs though. It is pretty cool. Now if that gets rid of the sap, that'd be kind of nice. Yeah, as meteors. I did not know that. Although, Eric, would you kindly get, if you'd kindly get up? <laughs> Repose. Oh, he's gone. And yet we're still moving up. I'm not done, am I? This must be really it, then. Kefka. Wait, Lilith? I guess Eric will not be joining us this fight, sadly. With Kefka, finally. Life. Dreams. Hope. Where do they come from? And where do they go? Such meaningless things. I'll destroy them all! Alright, Kefka, your funeral. The final battle with Kefka begins. Let's see how we let's see how we fare off against. Cause honestly, I'm not afraid of him. I don't fear him, Mr. Kefka. 
because I've I've gone too I've gone too far from this to to end off against him. And honestly, I get I'm glad I predicted that there. I'm glad I was using a healing then, because I didn't know you had Heartless Angel, Mr. Kefka. But honestly, seeing as I've seen that way too many times, doesn't surprise me now. Just as that doesn't. See, there. This is where your pro. This is what your problem is, Kefka. You're using things I've already seen now, and I've gotten used to it and over it. Even that I saw. Because honestly, if you really wanted to scare me, the end draws near. Um. I'm not liking the look on that face, though. That doesn't look like the face I like to. That's not a good face. Kefka, what are you up to? Why don't you stop that out before. Why don't you cut whatever that nonsense is? Nah, shaking is kind of ominous. That's some ominous shaking, I, uh, I won't lie. Forsaken? Um. Oh, hi. Ah! Oh, God. Please say that didn't kill anyone. Oh, okay. Oh! Did you just laugh at me, Kefka? Oh! Okay, yeah, you know what? You're dying. I am getting... Magic works, I guess. I need to watch out how I say these things. So... Kefka's dead now. I somehow me yelling at him to go die from him yelling at laughing at me just caused him to die. I guess it's finally over. Kefka has fallen finally. The warring triad is dead. So what does this leave for Lilith, the half Esper, and the world that Mr. Kefka here ruined? Oh, sweet death animation you have there, Kafka. Props to that. That Forsaken thing was kind of interesting, but... Honestly, not that troublesome, I suppose. I guess if I didn't go through the dragons, then I probably would have been saying something else, but whatevs. Goodbye, Mr. Goodbye, Mr. Kafka. See you later. Perhaps another time. The tower's collapsing! Oh no. Tomorrow and Kyle. There's no time to lose! Come on, the airship's just ahead. Come on, everyone. We can make it if we work together. Lilith, what's wrong? No oh, what? Um, that's not good. The Magicite. Magic is disappearing. If Vespers are fading from the world now, what will happen to Lilith? It's a good question, seeing as she is part Esper. Come with me. I can use the last of my power to guide you out. Simple pages, flips of a book. Senzo. Sian Garamande. Garamande. Hmm. I guess the real name of Senzo. 
I guess we already knew his name was Sion, but not his last name. <laughs> Senzo, can you hear that switch? Um, I, um, mechanical devices are uh, not my strong point. I do believe I'm getting better, though. Good job, Senzo. Sykes. Also known as... Setzer Gam Gambiani. Gambiani. Ah, my name's in his name. Sweet. Cool. Wait! Whenever you think you're right, you're wrong. And that's a big mistake. Oh, sucks, you clever bastard. And that's what you were always used to say, wasn't it, Daryl? Dar Eric. Edgar, Ronnie, Fig Figaro, and Rory. Sabine, Rene, Figaro. It's not like I wanted to dump all this responsibility on you. I know you'd look out for the kingdom. I wanted to be able to look out for you. That's why I went went off to become stronger. <laughs> and he gives me the finger one last time. Mr. Walkin, get bow. Or Mog, commonly known as. Mog, no! Help me! Kapow! No, Walken! No! Eric, please save Mr. Walken. Alright, that's good. That's a relief. The hair! Watch the hair! I'm not a stuffed animal! Kapow! Umaru. Otherwise known as simply Umaru. <laughs> the one character who didn't have a name change, apparently. It won't open! Oh my god! Oh my god! Um. Yeah! That happened. Ska. Ska. Go go. But buttons have to be pressed at the same time in exactly the same way. Scott, mimic Talia. Okay. I see no problem with that. Oh, poor Scott. Oh. No! And Kyle. Gao. Shortcut! Take shortcut!
Wow, that's a fun that's a fun looking shortcut. Shortcut takes shortcut. L. Lock Cole and Talia. Celes Shere. Celes Shere. Come on, this pe place is pe breaking apart. Let you, I won't let go, I promise. Are you crazy? You almost got yourself killed for that. Branford. The end of all of this. What of Lilith? Father? Lilith, we must part now. We espers will disappear from this world. You will fade away as well. But perhaps if the human part of you feels something strong enough, then maybe... Just maybe you will be able to remain here as a human. Athena. Realm Aroen, Aroni. Grandpa, I can't. You can't give up yet. Sorry, dear. Any more whining out of you, and I'll paint your picture. I don't know anything about that. Hmm. But you know, sometime I really would like to paint your portrait. On canvas, I mean. Oh, Athena. Look what you've done. You've made me go all misty eyed and I can't see where we're going. No touching. Kitty you. Shadow. Interceptor. Go on, Interceptor. Good going. Take care of yourself, boy. Baram, it looks like I can finally stop running. Come to Met and come find Met my end. Zeus. Strago Megas. So Kitty is leaving us, right? It's leaving forever. Come on, come on, Zeus, you can't let yourself be shot up by a bunch of kids! Gotcha!
and you. Follow me. Sykes is really get so Kitty is left behind forever. Thought of it best, so I guess he's figured it's best. Uh, he thought it was best for him to give his life. The last magicite. Cliff, you've done enough. Your power's getting weaker. Poor Kitty. And of all of them, he's pr he's not going to come back. Cliff isn't going to be able to hold on much longer. of Zaza. And we'll blizz. The orphanage that it Lilith has been taking care of all this time since the warring since Armageddon. Don't give up, Katrin. I won't either. Not yet. Not yet? Cliff! Thank you, Sex. I told you, didn't I? She's the fastest ship in the world. <sighs> and with that, this has been the Final Fantasy VI. <laughs> oh my God, I I don't know what to say. Um, this has been my first Let's Play, finally done after. When I first started in like July, I guess. Um, I guess I should, I guess, give my own thoughts what I thought of this game for the first time. I had a lot of fun with this game. This was really cool, very fun, very different from what I've normally done, especially doing a recording of my first time. I mean, yeah, there were some times I was like utterly lost. Other times I was confused. Probably one or two times I like think I lost my mind due to just sheer confusion. Just on the what scale. Only one time I think I was only close to quitting this, I guess, was horrible Fanax Tower, but still managed to persevere through that. Um, and what else am I trying to think? Yeah, like, I get story, this was probably the, one of the best games I've played in a long time, which I don't see that a lot. Like, truly, I've enjoyed this. This had a good, this was probably one of the best stories I've played, like, Music! Oh my god, this music was beautiful! I, I have never freaked out over how beautiful, how beautiful a soundtrack could be in my life. Oh, well, I guess that's not true. There's been several other games, but this is definitely going into the top now. Um, designs of any, everything has been great. I mean, and graphics have also been very nice. There's sprite quality. This has been nice. I mean, look at this right now in the credits. Like, this is beautiful. Like, this is truly beautiful. I love, and I, I just, there's just so much I liked. Even going, everything just worked for, for me, honestly. Even, even Miss, even Gefka. He, he's probably one of my, he's probably the one of my favorite parts in this entire game. Is Mr. Kefka, the, cr this crazy mad mage bent, hell bent on destruction for no reason other than hell. He doesn't understand. He just thinks it's fun. I like that. Especially the fact that you kind of see him progressively get even more douchier, like, I'm going to now poison an entire kingdom today, or 
I'm now going to absorb the magic of Esper's, or I'm going to blow up the entire world and become God! I mean, that's... that is awesome to me. I like that. And another thing I will say is I like how well-rounded everyone is. I like, I really do. Like, this is, this is truly amazing. Like, I'm probably just gushing now through this game for that I've only just now have been playing throughout this entire Let's Play, basically. But it's been fun doing so. <sighs> I, and I'm honest, honest to God, I'm surprised that I'm done. I mean, when I... When I thought I was going to do, when I did the Dragon's Den, oh god, that was, human, that was, that was hectic. I actually, like, honest to be truth, I had to use a map, actually, towards, towards that. Because there's a scrapped recording within that little, I guess, series there. After, and this was after the Ice Dragon was killed. I did a recording afterwards, just seeing if I could get to the next dragon. All I did was maybe 20 minutes of absolutely nothing. I was just lost, confused, I had no idea what happened, and all I got was a chest afterwards. And I got rid of it. I didn't, I just couldn't stand it. It was terrible. And after realizing just how lost I was, there's no way you guys could have seen me, like, progress through that dungeon with that kind of logic. I would, that would have, like, made this project go even longer than it should have been. So I, I sucked up my own pride and I used a map. Mostly so I could just figure out where I was to go. Afterwards, I kind of memorized the map and I kind of had a better sense of where things were once I had, again, explored the dungeon. And honestly, with that place, I had fun. It was difficult, but it was fun. Even, like, even the Geyser Dragon, I didn't even expect a boss that, diff that brutally difficult, but also kind of fun and challenging. Like, that is kind of stuff I was looking, I, I was kind of hoping to find, but that was cool. Even the whole final Kefka fight, like, fighting this gargantuan tower of things, this, like, gigantic tower that has... I, I get... There is probably symbolism to those things. I just now realize there's probably symbolism to a lot of that. Because there is a lot of, like, imagery to it, and I love it, and there's the Final Fantasy music I love! <sighs> oh my god, I... I this is probably been one. Of, this is probably when the I I I am so happy that this game is done. Like this has been a fun project for me to do. My very and especially for the first let's play. And I just know that if I continue this, this will get this can get better. So yeah, expect a new pro. I will be taking a break after doing this. I will. There will be some added stuff I'll do after this. I, I will tell you now, I will go and I will try doing that soul, the Soul Shrine that Mr. Kappa pointed out in Mubliz. I will try to go there. However, I will be taking a break for a while because I'd like to kind of just ease down, just kind of relax before I begin the next project, which will maybe be in like in a week or two. And we're, and we're seeing things repair, being rebuilt as we promised Kefka when he was killed, sadly. <sighs> this is pro this is so oh, I, oh, I'm so happy. There's so much other things I want to do that I have planned. That I am going to do is like little extra contribute to this let's play of mine. Just little things I couldn't do that I will be able to do, or I promise I will do. And we'll get them done as time goes on. But for now, I'm just going to just be quiet and let you guys watch the rest of this and enjoy this music. So. I have been Genesis 013, signing off once and for all. Good day, everyone.